It's Chris. I just want to leave you with an important message that has really helped me in my life. And that is that every morning I start off with some crazy, happy, fast paced music on my way into work. Why is that? Sometimes I could be listening to a podcast or listening to some other kind of learning or watching a video that I'm really not watching as I'm driving important stuff. But I found that the most important thing I can do to start my day is to get myself in the state where I'm going to be in a happy place, no matter what happened at home, no matter what is going to meet me as I get to the office. I have to be responsible for my attitude when I show up somewhere. I have to completely reset. I have to encourage myself before I can get there. Why? Because if I don't encourage myself, I can't encourage anybody else in that building. I can't be of any use to anyone else if I walk in pouting all morning or stomping around or being in a bad mood because it's not about me. It's about their day and that translates into our client's day and our agent's day and everybody else that we can help. I'm reminded of a, a scripture. It's 1 Thessalonians 5 where Paul is talking to the new church and now it's called Greece in that area. And what he told people the most important thing they could do is encourage each other every day. So one thing that I like to do every day is try to send a new text or a new message to somebody else, somebody that I haven't talked to probably in a while, and just encourage them out of the blue. Tell them that you're thinking about them. Just want to encourage them where they are. Uh, tell them that they're important. Tell them that you care about them. Just to keep connections alive and just pop into somebody's life where you don't even know what's going on right then. And your message to them could be the very thing that keeps them from going south doing something sad or feeling like they're alone because a lot of times in this business, especially as agents that work over the phone, we feel like we're all alone. So I encourage you to get around other people that can encourage you on a regular basis. You need to be encouraged all the time, but every day, how you start your day first, before you can, like they say in the airplane, before you can help somebody else put their mask on, you have to put your own mask on first. So I encourage you to get into the habit every day of getting yourself in the right state so that you can be a blessing to somebody else. You can help somebody else in that day. You got to get out of your own head and all the things that you're concerned about and start thinking about other people and how you're going to be in such a great mood that you are at a hundred percent when you get there because it's all up to you. It's your choice every day, despite your circumstances, despite your excuses, despite all the things that you're holding on to that say, these are my limitations. I can't because I have this problem, this problem, this problem. If you rise above that and look out and see all the other people that are in a worse situation than you are, you can suddenly come to the grips with the fact that you really don't have it that bad. And the opportunity that we have in this business and this country right now is incredible. It's never been the way it is right now. So I just want to let you know the way you want to start your day is if you want to be successful, encourage yourself. You have to start with you before you can affect and influence anybody else. Have a great day. Be encouraged. Bye-bye.